What's up everybody? This is gonna be my month nine update for my first niche website, trying to reverse engineer project 24. I'm gonna keep this one short, sweet, and just straight to the point. I'm gonna talk about my analytics for the last 30 days. I'm gonna show my Amazon affiliate income for the last 30 days on my niche site. I'm also gonna show my Ezoic ad revenue. And as a bonus, I just got monetized on YouTube so I'm gonna show how much I've made in the last three days after being monetized with the 2,000 subscribers that I have. So make sure to stick around and watch the whole video because I'm gonna cover all that stuff and include that bonus at the end. Let's just get right into it and check out the analytics. In the last 28 days, I've had just a little over 4,400 page views, which is still pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. At one point, I started getting a lot of page views on, on one particular article, which is my best article, but then it's died down. And I've also kind of seen that it's kind of slowed down a little and actually I'm getting a little bit less traffic. I got one post published this month, which I'm pretty happy about. Shout out to Big Bad Wolf Inc. They gave me some feedback and kind of a little bit of insider information. Not really too much, but I do want to give them a shout out for you know, just giving me some pointers and kind of reassuring me that I'm not letting it fall too far behind and I don't need to stress too much about getting the next site started right away. My site is doing pretty well. I have over 100 page views on all of my top 10 articles. So I think that's pretty good. I'm happy about that. And that's pretty much it for the analytics. For Amazon in the last 30 days here, you can see that I made $7.30 on affiliate commission for my blog website. My YouTube channel makes like nothing in Amazon commission. Since I've had Amazon going, I think I've had one sale and it was rather small. I don't know if that's just because people that go to the blog site are ready to make a purchase or more likely to make a purchase because the link's right there versus in the videos, the links are in the descriptions. And I also don't have a YouTube channel that really focuses on selling or reviewing items. So maybe that's another reason why I don't get any sales. I get a ton of clicks, but I never get any sales. Uh, but yep, yeah, that's, that's pretty much what I made for Amazon commissions over the last 28 days or last 30 days. However, Amazon does it. The analytics does 28 days, but Amazon does 30 days, which is pretty good. So that's seven bucks there. And then my Azoic ads have been doing pretty well. I'm pretty happy about that. Every month I make a little bit more this month. I made 28 bucks. Uh, it's starting to stack up. I almost got a hundred dollars total in my payment history. I'm kind of just banking that. I'm just gonna let it sit because I don't need that money right away and I'd rather just accumulate a, a decent amount before I pull it out because why not, right? I, it's, if, if I'm not gonna use it right away, I might as well just let it sit until it's a big enough you know, chunk of change that I can feel an impact from and maybe buy something for the office or who knows what I'm gonna do with that. Maybe roll it back into the website, maybe roll it into the next website. Since that's kind of what I started was an online business, I might as well just keep rolling that back into it and hopefully make more money from it. But right now it's it's 80 bucks and you know, all in all, $28 plus $7.30 from Amazon. I'm pretty happy with that. That's, you know, 35 bucks. It's 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 cool. It's it's nice to make a little bit of money every month like that. I I, I say it in every one of these videos. I was never expecting to make money on the internet and it's pretty cool that I'm starting to see it and to talk about making money on the internet, I have my YouTube numbers here that I wanted to share and again, I, I'm growing pretty fast. You can see I'm at 2,000 subscribers. It, I feel like it was just a month ago that I posted my 1,000 subscriber video. I've been growing cr like crazy. Here's my analytics for the last 28 days on this channel. You can see I've had 20,000 views, I've had 1,500 watch hours, I've had almost 600 subscribers, and my revenue has been $8.48. And this has just been over the last few days, right when I got monetized here on the 4th, and you know it started to pick up. Now I feel that maybe it's you know gauging how much I should be making. I'm still not sure how to use the analytics on the revenue side, of things, but it's pretty cool to have this here. I'm probably gonna block out some of my top earners just because I'm such a small channel. I feel like some of those might be targeting some good keywords that I don't really want people snagging up. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna leap those out, but I'll show how much I've made in my, you know, last 28 days, but really it's the last three days since I've been monetized. And I feel that my CPM is good. I was going in there and I was looking at the CPM for some of my videos and some of it's really high, um, which I'm super excited about. 
and I don't know yet. It's only been three days. It probably doesn't even know what they're supposed to be feeding my my viewers for ads or whatever, but you know, here it is. Here are the numbers. I wanted to share that. And if you're one of my viewers that watches my channel and you feel like I'm trying to be sleazy because I got ads, you, I've spent a lot of money on this office. I spent a lot of time doing this. I love doing it. Don't get me wrong. I, I do it because I enjoy it, but it's really nice to make a little money back from all the time and money that I've invested into it. And I love being able to help my viewers out. I know that my Project 24 viewers, you guys kind of come here just to see these videos and I appreciate you too. I wanna make some more videos on Project 24 stuff and the niche website, but I have so much on my plate that I'm just really trying to figure out which direction to take my channel. And I do wanna keep talking about learning how to code and possibly gonna start doing live coding and different stuff like that and, and getting more into programming and stuff that can help people who are trying to learn and become self-taught developers. So if you're here for Project 24 and you might wanna be a web developer or learn how to code, you might enjoy some of my other content, but if not, I totally get it. I hope that it doesn't bug you too much when you see my videos pop up and they have nothing to do with what you originally came here for. I hope this helps people out there who are thinking about starting a YouTube channel or thinking about starting a blog and they just want to, you know, have an idea of what they can make. Uh, my blog, you can watch the, the playlist of all my, my updates and you'll see that I've, I put a lot of money into my blog, so it's not making a ton of money. And now that I'm actually making money on YouTube, it's pretty cool that that that's happening and i'm pretty happy about that so with all that said i'm gonna wrap this up i wanted to keep it short and just update everyone because i don't want to let these fall to the wayside i always remember that at the at the beginning of the the month i have to get one of these videos out and i try to you know stay on top of it so if ever one's late or one's a little early i apologize i'm trying to do my best to just update you when i can with all that said thanks for watching if you enjoyed this video make sure to hit that like button let me know how your blog's going in the comments or if you're thinking about starting a YouTube channel. Or if you have a YouTube channel going and you want to share it, share it in the comments. I'm, I'm happy to check it out and, and see what you got. All right. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.